Hi. In this slide, I have sort of a, a, a theoretical depic depiction of the net profitability of all of the customers in a given niche. So once we have zeroed in on a niche and we've populated with as many people, customers as we think fit in the niche, we could do a customer net profitability rank report just for that niche. And we could look at deciles and we might see something like this. It's not uncommon to find a company that's breaking even uh, with a financial operating profit line, their number one biggest niche, as far as just volume and margin dollars, is you know break even. Maybe it makes a little bit of money because there's so much uh, offsetting profit and unprofit in the in the niche. So what happens is, you know, we'll look at the top of the report and we'll see a couple of customers that are making enormous amounts of profit. We'll look at the bottom and we'll see some other big customers because you can only you know, have big losses if you're a big customer who need to be converted. So imagine seeing these guys go back up here. These guys in the middle typically are small and maybe they fall fallen below the threshold of, of, of what is uh, capable of what our service model can take care of and we need to basically you know take them away from outside reps give them to a call center uh, unbundle freight have strict minimums raise prices a little bit so it's a model where we can make money taking care of them going forward particularly if they buy more items from us a little bit less often which will help them do um, so uh, We'll get something like this, and of course, you know, we want to figure out why these are so profitable and, and, and get even more share and take them higher. There's a dynamic upside to all of these because we've never renewed the niche before, and we're to convert these guys to winners also. Um, so don't think that your number one best potential niche is necessarily sensationally profitable. It, it has the potential to be sensationally profitable, but even as it is right now, you could see a lot of downside drag from the right side of the graph. Thank you.